so how do you, how in 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 practical terms um, do, you, do you make phone calls to people that you know? Do you do you try to create uh, symposiums? Yes. Do you try to uh, how do you do you have uh, service or ser services dedicated to awareness and just coming together to hear mm -hmm. no. this breakthrough mm -hmm. and, and to have this. Um, to have this, uh, to meet, to meet each other where they are, yeah. this communal uh, celebration of each other. The first, when we first started doing this, we presented forums. Those forums were to bring people, pastors, and parishioners. We wanted infected and affected people there. We gave three of those forums. By the time we did the last one, we had over 100 people of cross community in the same room working towards the same cause. And everybody left feeling really good about where they were. We've done several forums with pastors. We've also done a Black Church Week of Prayer programs where we would give uh, initiatives to our, at least recognition to churches who had reached out in some way to work in the HIV community. So we've gone to churches that have opened up their door and actually did HIV testing in some churches. And surprisingly, in one of the churches we were testing in, we found a young man who was HIV positive. So people don't believe that the church needs to do these kind of things, but we do. Uh, we presented the Test One Million campaign to this city where we uh, engage the lieutenant governor and many other council people and every AIDS organization from Cleveland back to Cincinnati we all met in Columbus and agreed to unify for the first time in this fight around HIV AIDS so we did a one-year campaign that the Ohio Minority Commission uh, financially supported as well as the alcohol drug uh, treatment for facilities that they supported. And that was a unified effort that had never happened in our city before. And so we continued to look for ways to put safe environments that we can bring our communities together around this issue of HIV AIDS uh, one piece at a time. We eat that elephant one piece at a time. And I think that's how we're going to be able to be successful as an organization in helping the community. And, and what about money? Money. Many people talk about money. And I, and I asked uh, Phil Wilson, I said, how much, how much is needed? I asked that question and he smiled. Yeah. You know, because that inevitably I hear that there's a, you know, there's a lot of money that's needed. But, but what I hear from you is, I know, I know you have a clear understanding of what has to be done. Mm -hmm. And, and you, you're clear in your mission. How are you doing financially? How are you doing in terms of your grants? How's, uh, what more do you need to make things happen? 